No wonder I was often eager to get it over with by the time Sunday dinner finally ended and the last dish was cleaned. Sometimes, if my mom got distracted with something after dinner, the waiting would really get to me. On a number of such occasions, I eventually broke down and went to her myself with chart and slipper in hand to ask for my spanking. Even without the demerit charts and slippers, everyone in my neighborhood seemed to know about my spankings from conversations with my moms and gossip spread by my babysitters. Michael's situation wasn't much different. One reason I was so glad to go away to boarding school was that I would finally be at a school where no teachers knew I was still spanked. It was bad enough in elementary school to have teachers tell me I deserved a good spanking for something I had done and then listen while they called my mother to make sure I got one later that day.